Welcome to Park Royal Homestay at Club Cala, Puerto Rico. This is the main lobby which is under renovation now. So let's go in and see the rest of the timeshare. This is the unit that I am staying at. So let's go inside. You enter right into the living room. Where they have a couch. And across the room, they have a dresser and a TV and a chair. In the same room, you have a dining area and you have your kitchen with the stove and microwave and your refrigerator and dishwasher. So it's your basic kitchen. Now moving up the stairs in the back of the room, and we come to a bedroom. This one has two twin beds and the view is of a wall. Turning back into the room, the twin beds and a very big closet. Now behind the door, we have a shower and a toilet. Continuing back into the stairway, we go up the stairs and to your right is another sink area and another bathroom with a shower and a toilet. Back around. This is the master bedroom with a good sized bed. This room has a view of the courtyard. There's some games out there and over in that direction is the swimming pool. Back into the room, there's a chair, a TV across from the bed, and then your bed. Well, that's the timeshare. At this resort, they have a nice outdoor swimming pool right next to the registration area. They have a little coffee shop by the pool and a temporary registration area over there. They have restrooms by the pool and the main lobby is currently not available because it's being renovated. They have smaller units next to the pool. They also have two bedroom units next to the pool and this is where I am staying in one of the two bedroom units. There are two rows of units on this side of the street across from the check-in place. Some of the units are down by the water but you can't get to the harbor from here because of the fence but you can see it over the fence and here are some of the units back here they do have a small area here with a couple of games you can play 
Here is the large swimming pool, which is under renovation, and it looks like it has a swim-up bar, so that'll be interesting. And they also gave us a free midweek cleaning. They used a pair of glasses to create this creature. I also want to mention that the timeshare did have a washer and dryer in it, but I did not get a picture of it. Well, it's the last day of vacation and we've had a great time. I went and traveled to a bunch of different places, went to Ponce, went to uh, San Juan, went to the tropical rainforest, went to a nature preserve, went to the beach. I mean, just did a whole bunch of stuff, but all of those things required a lot of driving. So if you stay here, you're gonna need a rental car because there's not very much to do at this resort. Now, the room was very nice. It was comfortable, clean, and the bed was comfortable. So I have no complaints about the timeshare. The uh, largest swimming pool was under renovation and so was the main lobby. So none of that's in the video, but I won't be able to give you an opinion if it's good or bad. Overall, I would say I'd recommend this resort because there are not many resorts in Puerto Rico to choose from. So overall, I'd say it's worth coming here, but you just need a rental car and it's going to take a while to drive everywhere because it was like an hour and a half to get to Ponce and an hour and a half to get into San Juan from here. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this video. So until next time, see ya.